Hello and welcome to Zim Badges at ZimJS.com. This is the art version, so you get to make art and learn how to code and get badges. So that's a win win win. Woohoo! Let's see what we're going to be making. For the first badge, you'll get a circle to show up on the canvas, and the canvas is where we make the art. For the second badge, we'll use a loop to efficiently put many, many circles and animate circles on the canvas on the stage. For the third badge, we'll add a navigation bar and prepare ourselves to go to other art pieces. In the fourth badge, Woo! We'll use noise to make... Oh, look at that! Isn't that cool? And so you can change how quickly that goes. Or slow it down. And we'll use sliders as well to control our art. Nice, huh? For the fifth badge, we'll see how to use tiling to create tiles like that. Oh, neat! Woo. For the sixth badge, we'll use blobs to let people create interactive art. So they can move these around and you can change here. We'll change these things. Woo! Wiggle, wiggle. These ones have them too. So you can change shapes like that and let people create their own art. Boodoop. Boodoop. <laughs> Nice, huh? So that is Zim badges, as well as the page controls to be able to go from one piece of art to the other. On the badges site, each section has a bunch of steps. So here are the steps, and each step has links off to the documentation. It has uh, the ability to highlight it, to mark it. It has more information, which leads you to videos, captures or code that will show you more about the topic. It also has, of course, the answer. So isn't that neat? And then once you're finished all of the steps, then you can claim your badge, which looks like that. Yay! Woohoo! And there's six badges here at zimjs.com where you can search for the badges section in the learn section of Zim and try out different badges as well. Have a great day. I'm Dr. Abstract. <laughs> Ciao.